going on AMC Nation? John Wick sniping back again. Um, just wanted to uh, talk to you guys real quick. Obviously, we're having a nice couple days, but you know we're not here for this. I mean, just like we don't pay attention at 13, 14, 15, we're not paying attention at 16, 17, 18, 20, 30, 40, 50. I mean, before we can get ex even excited again, I think we got to get back into the 50s. So, um, the other thing I wanted to uh, go over with you guys real quick is that um, my videos with these brokerages that I record, they're actually really important. No other YouTuber is doing this. Everybody else is in a park or in their house talking and giving their opinion at the end of the day. I'm actually giving you guys concrete potential evidence that you can use and refer to should something go wrong with this play and paying us out. So, for instance, let's just say they decide to cap us at $200 a share. Example, only an example. They want to cap us at $200 a share, okay? You'll be able to refer to my videos and say, hey, look, I got this guy that I, I'm subscribed to, and his name's John Wick Snipin, and he has your representatives basically saying that there is no cap, there will be no cap, that everything's going to be kosher. So... I really wish that my videos and my channel really reached a lot further out because I'm looking at some of these other guys with bigger channels and I'm like, they're not even offering anything viable to you. They're, they're just opinions, really. You know what I mean? And at least I'm getting on the phone uh, with these brokerages and recording them and I've got no problems recording them. If they want to come after me, come after me because that way I'll be able to say, okay, cool. You're coming after me, I'm coming after you. You're cheating me on that end and I need to see what you're doing because my money's involved. So I want to know and I want answers to these questions as to how are you able to continuously keep this uh, stock price down. So the last thing I'm worried about is recorded conversations. Furthermore, they state that they record all the conversations for quality assurance. So if you, want, if you don't want to use my video, then let's use your video and it better match or your call, recorded call, and it better match the shit you were telling me on my uh, recorded conversation. So I'm not worried about anything like that. I also really wanna uh, say thank you to my supporters. I don't call you subscribers. And I'm talking about the people that I actually acknowledge as a supporter. Yeah, I'm talking to you guys. You are my motivation. You're my motivation for doing this. Okay, so I really, really appreciate you guys always showing me love in the comments. I know you're subscribed. I know you guys watch my content as soon as you actually can. And I really, really thank you for that. You are supporting me and I am motivated to continue doing what I'm doing to help our entire AMC nation out get these answers until we squeeze. So we know we're not there right now. Yeah, it's all nice that we're back into the 18s and, you know, we're flirting with possibly going into the 20s. But it really doesn't mean anything because they took all that from us in the last month. So until we get back into at least the 30s that we can start really like getting a little excited and then into the 50s and beyond, um, there's really nothing to look at. There's really nothing to look at at the share price. It wasn't anything to look at when it hit 13, 14, 15, 16. There's nothing to look at 17, 18, 20, even until we get back into the 30s. So, but I am happy that at least we're trending in the right direction. And uh, I, I know that our time is, is near. So again, if you're watching me, join me, help me, help keep me motivated. Tell somebody else that's an AMC owner. Hey, this guy's, you know, he's going out there and he's trying to get us these answers because, you know, obviously for the ones that are watching me, you're benefiting from my content, but I'd love for the whole nation, the whole AMC nation, every stock owner to kind of watch my content so that they can answer some of these questions that I know that I've gotten answered in the last few videos that I've, that I've put together. Um, as a matter of fact, one of the latest things that came out from my last call with Fidelity and my transfers of my shares from Weeble to Fidelity, there was that transfer amount. So keep that in mind if you're in Weeble and Robinhood that they're going to charge you an amount of money. You know what I mean? It, it may just be worth it regardless, but you also have to keep in mind that they're going to charge you something. So that was just a quick video. I'm going to be uh, out back 
back later with some other videos, but uh, John Wick sniping is out for now. Thanks.